The search for a 71-year-old missing Jupiter father came to a tragic end when his body was found in the Hungryland Wildlife Preserve nearly a day after he was last seen. And tonight, Robert Yeager is being remembered as a devoted family man, a retired member of the U.S. Air Force, and a former prosecutor who served as a mentor for veterans in our area. CBS 12's Lily Ortiz joins us outside an American Legion post in Tequesta, where members are honoring him tonight. Fellow veterans are saddened about Robert Yeager's passing. Members of American Legion Post 271 in Tequesta here led a small prayer service for him, and you could just feel how much he will be missed. We always want to make sure that we remember them, remember our fallen, and one of the ways to do that is, you know, prayer. Following the devastating discovery of Robert Yeager's body Tuesday, members of American Legion Post 271 gathered to remember their former commander. The 71-year-old was a retired lieutenant colonel of the U.S. Air Force JAG Corps, and as a prosecutor, he actually advocated for veterans who ended up on the wrong side of the law. Nice and, and caring person. He brought a lot to us. He was part of our honor guard. As a matter of fact, he was the leader of our honor guard, so a lot of us old guys go out and do things for veterans. Authorities found Gager's body Tuesday in the Hungry Land Preserve near Jupiter Farms after a multi-agency search in the air and on the ground. A great dad, just, uh, just a real all-around really great guy. and You could just feel it in the room, you know, how we miss him being here. He was. Chief Assistant for the Palm Beach County State Attorney's Office, Craig Williams, knew and worked with Yeagers for almost 30 years. It's a loss for the community and definitely a loss for our office. Bob was kind of one of my mentors, um, so it, it was actually great for me to have him as a mentor because he was so kind. Uh, he cared so much about doing the right thing all the time. Williams says Yeager was fiercely dedicated as a prosecutor in the county's Veterans Court program, helping vets break the cycle of criminal behavior and encourage them to get the mental health services they needed. It's what made Jaegers one of a kind. We wanted to have a veteran who was in there who knew uh, what a lot of the veterans were going through. So Bob was the perfect person because he knew what they were going through. He worked uh, day and night to try to make sure that they got the services that they need so we could get them on track, get them out of the system. I spoke to your son, Robbie, on social media. He wanted to thank all the law enforcement officials for their search efforts and for the community support during this difficult time. Meantime, detectives are handling this as a death investigation and will release more information as soon as it becomes available. In Tequesta, I'm Lily Ortiz, CBS 12 News.